He had something really good, but it's it's, it's for, yeah. not today. That's a shame. Yeah. New. We gotta do names. What kind of professional streamer are you? I know. I say professional. But... <laughs> Believe me, I'm very amateurish. <laughs> well, I'm, I'm Twitch were good it's enough to give, me, uh, to give me a to give me a a partnership. Getting there. So yeah, like that's I guess like semi professional. Do you have custom emotes yet? Uh, I'm working on them. Yeah. Shades. Shades. Right where emo it's gonna be a pair of shades. That's pretty good. And I'm gonna have a Sonic Boom one as well. They're my first two. I think you can only have two at the start until you yeah, get a yeah. few subs. So uh, those are some pretty good choices, yeah. Hmm. So Ref nutrient sponsored by Reflex Bars. <laughs> really? <laughs> the protein bars? No, no, no. The uh, the the chain of eighties bars in oh, the UK. Right, right, yeah, right. yeah. Okay. Yeah. Uh, Nutrients. Whenever we, as a group, travel to a, a tournament, uh, myself, Aaron, and, and Nutrients, without fail, end we'll up it. in a reflex bar. Okay, I see. Yeah, that's pretty good. Yeah, and some of them are the most diviest places I've ever <laughs> been, with the stickiest floors. But you don't care because they're playing eighties music. Yeah. Know? Anyway, oh, I get the feeling this is going to be one dry ass fight. It will, yeah. Mm. Mm. Both these players are. They're both going to take this as an insult, but they're kind of similar. <laughs> they're both going to take that as an insult. But what I mean is, There's right? There's no winner to that. Yeah, they both play kind of dry. They do, yeah. But they both know tons I of wacky yeah. shit. Yeah, they do. See you, Sophie. It's good to see you. Yeah, I should. I should really do that. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> take care. Um, they both play really dry, but they both have loads of crazy setups and and, and wacky stuff that they, they pull do, out yeah. in clutch moments, you know. So. Um, Look at this. Oh my god, the Sahara here. Yeah. So, myself and Aaron went to Evo this year. Yeah. And then one day we decided we'd drive to LA. Right. Right as well. When we were coming back, we had to drive through Death Valley, the, mi the middle of yeah, the yeah, desert. Yeah, the desert. Yeah. There was an accident on the road that meant there was a maybe 30 mile tailback with okay. no movement. Uh, Right. Nutrien takes the first round there, right. by the way. Just Sorry for interrupting. That, sitting there in the middle of the desert, hmm. waiting for the traffic to move, is less dry <laughs> than this fight. Shots fucking fired. <laughs> <laughs> this is a pretty dry fight. It is pretty dry, <laughs> yeah. Oh, wow. I think that might be my finest moment of commentary. That was pretty good, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Oof. Oh, good with punish. Oh, look at this corner pressure, the lockdown. Is that the first round? This is the second round. This, this is the second fight. No, it's the second round. Second round. Yeah. Jeez. The first round went to Nutrient. Mm. Oh, overhead. He loves that overhead. Yeah. It's oh, a, yeah. Walk up, nothing costs him that. Ooh, look at this. This is going to be an interesting round. Two fully charged critical arts going into it. Now watch them sit and do nothing, nothing. with it. Oh, okay. With oh, no one's going to... Oh, yeah. walk back. Yeah, just just let him walk up. Well, I guess Az is happy for him to put Corpus in the corner, but that here we go. That was actually really good uh, confirm yeah. off the counter hit. Mm. I respect that. It's going to hurt. Bang. 50% of his health. Good oh, meeting. it's mounting up. Look at that stun. Oh, that's going to be careful. If the guess was just a little bit earlier. Oh, this is not looking good, but he has the critical art unlock. He needs maybe oh, three combos now. Cross up. First fight goes to the loneliest of towns. Ooh, irony. <laughs> bison grabbing bison by the face. Yeah. By the way, driving through that desert actually was spectacular. Really? Yeah. There's mount just fucking mountains yeah, yeah. everywhere. I've never seen the like. But anyway. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Ooh. Video me. I think he was yeah. he was expecting a jump out this for the dolphin yeah, dive. Yeah. Like. But you kind of have to establish that you might dolphin dive yeah. in the other guy's head before. I mean, he has tried to mm -hmm. dolphin dive. He's gotten whiff punished for it almost oh, okay. every time. So. Oh, oh wow. here we go. There's some momentum. Choo for choo! Him. Here comes the bison train. And Birdie's right back. He's going to throw him out of the corner. That's questionable. 
Oh. Oof. This is an interesting trade. I call that in Birdie's favor, to be honest. Yeah. Oh, Block. oh well, he's just, just using that can. meter. Is that safe? I assume it is. It is safe, yeah, yeah, but okay. Next hit kills. Yeah, but neither guy has like is uh. even close to a critical art, so this could take yeah. a while. Birdie has one... Oh, uh, I was about to say Birdie had one unsafe move there because mm. he had V-Trigger. He could have gone for slide or something, you know. It didn't pan out. No, it really didn't. Ooh, neutral jumps. Everyone neutral yeah, jumping. It's a party. <laughs> that guy who uh, must be one of the striders in the background who can shoot fire from his mouth. Oh, that's Wizard versus Ninja. In that. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, that's so good. But the story behind this stage, I want to know what's going on everywhere in it. Yeah. Mm. Who are these people? Mm. Have you seen uh, if you pick... Uh, I can't remember who it was, but there's a thing where... Sagat's head will actually appear? Yeah, it's uh, story mode. Oh, is it story yeah, mode? Okay. Yeah. I think they could charge a lot of fight money for that and people would just pay it just to have the Sagat's the on Sagat the stage, yeah. in, in the game somehow. Like if the character model is there, use it, you know mm -hmm. what I mean? Yeah, that's why I think everyone thinks Abel's going to be in year two and the Capri because they're in the game. Like, right. Hmm? Oh, that was excellent preemptive. Was. Pays off. Ooh. Ooh. Time to start teleporting, Bison. That's a bad time to eat. Yeah. Oh, you're gonna get pushed. Oh my god, the walk down. Oh. No answer. Oh, oh, the overhead. I wouldn't have blocked that. No, I would I. I'll be honest with you. You hit them buttons. You hit them buttons. They're pretty good buttons to be hitting, to be honest. Look at that. Yeah. Boom. <laughs> the boat just neutral jump with the oh jump combo. Hey. I wonder what the read was there for neutral. Goes another corner. Safe. All the safe pressure. Even good players, you know, they don't leave themselves in safe very often, yeah. you know. Oof. My button's better than your button. Yeah. Oh. Now nah, that's got to be frustrating. Yep. To be honest, that's got to be a frustrating way to lose. Yeah, you, know, you got to deal with that as a tournament player, and then the nutrient has to go like, you know, what do I do? What is the adaptation? Yeah. Which button do I press to beat that one? A hard button. That's medium, right? Yeah. So I guess I. Like, is that how the the priority system works? There is a priority system. It's the first Street Fighter, I think, with a priority, with a priority system. system. Um, but it's actually it kind of works because right. in this particular game, there's an awful lot of strong medium buttons, mm. and there's an awful lot of slow heavy punch buttons, mm. and it's kind of, you know, okay, you're using your medium to just dominate me in footsies, crush counter. It's it, you know, it's an interesting uh, niggle in the footsies game, you know. But does it not then heavily sway things in favor for the characters with the good heavy buttons? Well, yeah. yeah, they're they're very like yeah. they're the dominant characters, yeah. like like characters. <laughs> oh, wow. I saw that the character yeah. information coming up on the screen. Yeah, yeah that's interesting. It's pretty good. Isn't it? Now, as is on match point. Ooh, ooh, D ex dolphin dive. That's what the BS is going to start now. Oof. Oh, oh, combo breaker. We're playing Killer Instinct now. <laughs> you get a combo out of their combo. Yeah. K -k 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 combo breaker. Where's Ben when you need him? Or RDA Aegis Banana, as I like to call it. Yeah. This is the scariest inanimate object in history. <laughs> yeah, dun 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 dun. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you can't play Footsie, son. The trickery. I'm amazed. You can go oh. oh, he's had enough of it. Yep, reacting. Now, to here it. comes the Azza shit. Oh, Ooh. that was pretty good. Yeah, excellent, because that wears down the V trigger as well. You know, he's on his his back and it's still mm. decreasing. Yeah, oh. Slides onto a banana. He's risking it for a biscuit, but he does have one round which nutrient doesn't. Oh no, he gives up his critical art. I'm not sure mm. about that at all. He needs it. Oh, oh. the top of dive goes over him. Oh, I don't even know what to say. 
<laughs> Don't even know what to say about that, to be honest. Four hours in the desert for that. That was pretty sad, actually, yeah. to be honest. Should have been out. Now we have a loser semi final. Fergus versus Azza. Fergus, who needed to study more when he was playing Gobblecock. Yeah, I heard about this. Yes. Chiquito told him. Yes. Yeah. It's one of my favorite FG memories. Mm. Uh, CKT. What's up? Uh, are they...